Is the American dream of owning a home becoming more of a fantasy? With rising interest rates, low inventory, and inflation increasing the cost of living, renting may be a more realistic option. In fact, renting a starter home is currently cheaper than buying it in all 50 of the US's largest metropolitan areas. The debate on whether to rent or buy is not new, but with the current real estate market, there may be new things to consider. High mortgage rates significantly contribute to the current high cost of home ownership. CBRE estimates that the average mortgage payment has increased by 75% since 2019. This surge has made owning a home unattainable for many, effectively pricing them out of the market. They also predict that it could be another five years or more, depending on the location, before mortgages lower and make home ownership more accessible. So is renting the new buying? A report from Realtor.com found that starter home rental prices have been dropping incrementally over the past several months. Though these drops are only a few dollars per month, these decreasing rental medians combine with higher ownership costs to create a market that favors renters. A home can be a great financial asset for someone, and building equity is a huge incentive to buy. But as with any investment, You'll want to be sure you're working within your financial means. Sure, a tax break for mortgage interest sounds great, but is it worth it if you're struggling to make your monthly payments? With home prices continuing to rise, you can consider renting a good option to wait out the market or simply save for a larger down payment to keep up with the competition. Location is also crucial. Renting might be more advantageous in large cities, but this isn't always true for smaller cities or rural areas. The first step is to gather data. Look at your own finances. Calculate how much you can spend on your housing per month, then add up how much cash you have on hand for a down payment or deposit. Then look at the market data. How much does it cost to rent a home in your area? Then compare that to what it would be to buy. This includes the interest rate, length of the loan, and if you'd pay any private mortgage insurance or PMI. Consider as well the intangible. How long do you plan to stay where you live? What are the important factors in your housing situation? Owning a home will usually be a better financial investment in the long run, if you're able to set yourself up for success. But it will always be the smartest choice to live within your means and save for your goals, rather than chasing what you cannot afford. Ultimately, what's most important is to make an informed decision that aligns with your financial situation and lifestyle preferences. And if you want more content like this from MarketWatch and the Xplainomics playlist, please subscribe and keep checking back for more videos. And we'll see you next time.